Okay, so we're testing the max capable power of the 60 volt now. Came to the conclusion that that one there could do uh, 2250 max, and let's see what this one can do. Okay, here we are. Got the Nero set up. We're taking zero watts right now, and we're gonna plug in 300 watt halogen. This inverter, is, it's curious, this one is just set to 126 volts, that one 115. I think it's because the first one I specified 115 and this one I didn't, so they just defaulted at that voltage. So I'm wondering at the higher voltage, will this put out more power? That's what I'm curious about. So, let's turn this on. I, I jumpered past this uh, very cheaply. Okay. <clears throat> we are jumping in power. <coughs> Input volts. Input output staying pretty good. We got 2,000 watts. I should put this to low. What do we got now? This one's already putting out more power than the other one just because it's got a higher output voltage. That's already 50 watts more than the other one would do. Now let's do overcurrent. Let's see what it does. I'm going on to high with this. Uh, now that's on high. Wow. Input voltage sagging to 116. Wow, this one's actually working good. Look at that. 2800 watts. That's a lot more than the other one was doing. Very interesting. I like this one. Okay, well, I'm gonna turn that back down. I'm gonna shut this off. So on a short test, this, this one's a lot better than this one. Wow, I, I don't know exactly why. I'm thinking uh, the higher input voltage makes it so it can handle uh, more watts, and the higher output voltage also is helping this or both of those are lower on this one. That is a very interesting. Because this one's a 2,000 watt. This one actually is almost a 3,000 watt. So I can actually take the sticker back off. That, I, that That's very good and I'm very happy with that. I already, con well, I contacted them that I was very displeased with this one. But uh, this one's working pretty good. So there you go, that's the graph. That was like 2,800 and some odd uh, watts there. Uh, won't show me. I've got to go to history. Let's go like this. History. Okay, it doesn't really give me a whole lot there. Oh well. Wow. I'm impressed with this one. I'm very happy. If that lasts me a long time, I'll be happy with that inverter. This inverter. Not very happy with it at the moment. Not putting out enough power. Wondering if there's some settings in there that I can change. <coughs> but uh, I didn't get the, quite the 3000 watts, but over 2800. So that's not bad. It's definitely at least a 2500 watt inverter with no, pretty much no surge, which is at this price point, that's okay. But this one, not okay. That one's way under. So I'm gonna contact the company and see what's going on and maybe we can uh, fix this.